don't think that's a good idea. So what changes have you noticed since the last session? Nothing, to tell the truth. Oh, can't you, because you never try. All right, Sam. What do you think about it? Well, look, I, I just... cannot understand why he doesn't appreciate what I do for him. I come home from work, cook, clean, iron, shop, and I never hear thank you from him. He doesn't even notice me. He still spends more time with a bottle of whiskey writing his book than talking with me. Oh, you. anything is better than talking to you. Excuse me? Oh, nothing. I just don't understand how these sessions actually help us. I mean, nothing ever follows on from this. I don't, I don't even get to say a word. Everyone has their turn. Oh, bullshit. I'm sorry, but she sits here and talks about her feelings. Who cares about how I feel? You know what? Fuck me. I'm leaving. Sam? While we're at it, is it so hard to make yourself look nice like Will here? What? Oh, sorry. I never meant it like that. Okay. That's enough for today. Look, I have no idea how she's managed to get me back here, but if we're here, then I want to go first. Go on. Okay, let me start by saying that I understand that there exists a problem in our relationship. You know, I'm not the perfect fiancé. You know, m maybe I have been a little bit too distant. Are you listening, Jade? Hmm? Oh, I just think I'd like to forget about everything and be loved again. I feel so lonely. That's exactly how I felt. You know, every time I try and organise something or, you know, spend time with you, you always say you're busy. Once more, you know, you, you say I don't help around the house with the housework or keeping it clean, but what's the point in having this amazing, well-kept house if, if there's no if there's no love in it? Jade, we've we've drifted apart, and it hurts. You know, it really hurts. Probably hurts too much. Thank you, Samuel. Would you care to comment, Jade? Yeah, I think everything's on a good way. Our relationship gets better and better. I have an impression that he understands me completely. You know, he just gives me a feeling of safety and confidence. I look forward to meeting that sexy Speffy tomorrow. I believe you two have successfully explained your problems. Now, all you need to do is forgive each other and start again. You mean, this is our last meeting? I strongly believe your relationship doesn't need my help anymore. Yeah. Yeah, no, the relationship's going to be great. I wish you both all the best. What? I don't understand. Oh, don't play stupid with me. I know you're ending these meetings. You can meet up with her afterwards. What? Sam, you're crazy. I can agree with her. Oh, you bastard!